Hello, friends. I'm glad to be with you in prayer today. For this week in our morning prayers, I continue to be lifting up prayers based upon language of inclusion found in Scripture. And today I'm going to offer a prayer about serving others. Let's pray together. Oh, Heavenly Father, give me a heart like the heart of Jesus, a heart more ready to serve than to be served, a heart moved by compassion towards the weak and oppressed, a heart set upon the coming of your kingdom in the world of men and women. I pray for all the different kinds of people to whom Jesus gave special concern and care when he was on earth, for those needing food or drink or clothes, for the sick and all who are wasted by disease, for the blind, for the disabled, for people suffering from life-shattering diseases like leprosy in Jesus' time and HIV AIDS in ours, for prisoners, for those oppressed by any injustice, and for refugees and asylum seekers, for the homeless and all the lost sheep of our society, for all victims of sexual, sexual exploitation and abuse, for the lonely, for all single parents, for the worried and anxious, for those who are living faithful lives in obscurity, for those who are fighting bravely for unpopular causes, for all those who are working diligently for you throughout our world. Amen. A reading is from the book of Mark from the ninth chapter, verses 35 through 37. Sitting down, Jesus called the twelve and said, If anyone wants to be first, they must be the very last and the servant of all. And he took a little child and had him stand among them. And taking him in his arms, he said to them, Whoever welcomes one of these little children in my name welcomes me. And whoever welcomes me does not welcome me, but the one who sent me. Friends, this is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Have a blessed day. And remember to serve others.